right, you guys. So we're finally getting some snow. This is unbelievable. It's not going to accumulate, but it's December 30th, 2021. I wanted you guys to see that we are getting some snowflakes falling from the sky. This is amazing. It's 37 degrees. And they're big, fat, beautiful snowflakes. This is like the nicest snow we've had out of the whole storm. <laughs> so you guys had to, yeah, you have to at least see this. So obviously this is the side of town over by like Boulder Bay that typically gets more snow anyway. It'll be interesting to see what it's like when we get to the other side. Well, not, not the other side, to the middle of town where I live where it'll probably still be sunny. But this is really beautiful. I at least wanted you guys to see some snowfall for Pete's sake. For Pete's sake. And then at seven o'clock, once I'm done with my regular job, I'm going to bed. That's what I keep on saying, but I promise you I'll be going to bed because there'll be nothing left out here. And then we'll do the aftermath tomorrow and I'll load the, the time lapse, which isn't gonna be as awesome as I wanted it to. Yeah, we're getting some snow. This is great. So beautiful, these big snowflakes, you guys, I'm telling you. Okay, so we decided to turn down one of the side streets just to keep on driving through the snowflakes for a little bit because I have a feeling when we get back to my house, it's gonna be not cloudy. This is just a little tiny, tiny little bit, nothing special. But as I said, this is the most that we've recorded through this whole storm. Incredible. It's not gonna accumulate, so don't get too excited. But these roads are nasty to drive on right now, or these side roads. Because it's slushy, I'm having a hard time. I mean, comparatively to when I'm driving on the regular road. So we're gonna take this street, Edgemore, down to Lakeview. And be good. We'll take that all the way and then we'll get stuck in traffic down there, but that's okay. That is okay. You guys have taught me how to be, look at that snowman. Taught me how to be more patient with things. And I really do appreciate that because I am pretty impatient about things. Especially driving on slush like this. Holy moly. It's not, it's really difficult actually. Because it just takes you wherever it wants it, wherever it wants you to go. So these turns you gotta take even slower. Once again, don't get too excited about this. This is gonna end in about 20 minutes, and it's not gonna get really any heavier than this, but it's still beautiful big snowflakes. And it's 20 or 36 degrees. We haven't driven this route on a video in a long time, so this is this is gonna be kind of cool. I'll show you guys where we're at. Okay, we should be coming up here. I'm pretty sure to Lakeview. Yep, here's Lakeview. Make a hang a right here. I'm telling you, I am so excited to be able to not have to worry about going out because that's that keep that keeps me awake because I'm constantly looking outside to make sure that as soon as something starts, I don't miss anything because it takes a little bit of time to upload these videos. So I want you guys to get them as fast as possible. Wow, I'm glad we 
we got to record some like actual snowflakes falling from the sky because last night it was like a snowy icy mist it wasn't really snowflakes it was it was it was different okay so now on this part of lakeview we will be riding along the lake that's right so if you look over here to the left there's the beautiful lake right behind these houses man i'm telling you what a great location to have a house wouldn't you say Look at that, jeez Louise. And so many of these are Airbnbs. Every house has like like one of those, those rental signs on the front. This one doesn't. Lucky people get to live there permanently, that one does. This one next to it does. This one does. Unbelievable. Let's see, this one does or not? Nope, oh yeah, that one does, that's a, that's a rental also. Guys, these are all rental properties. It's just amazing. Every single one. So if you guys want to come stay on the lake, I mean, every single one of these, you can rent. It's so gorgeous though. That view, man, that view. Woo, look at that peekaboo, peekaboo view. This is one of my favorite places to stay, the Big Bear Frontier, but when we stay here, we stay on this side, on this lake one, at, at Frontier 2, right on the lake. It's amazing. I have videos of both of the ones right on the lake, on, on my uh, playlist. Look, as soon as we get back into town, look at the skies now. The snow's hardly coming down. And by the time we get back to the Moon Ridge area, there will be no snow falling from the sky, I'm assuring you that. We're pretty close to assuring you that. <laughs> Man, that guy, I wish I had the courage to drive like that. So this is the traffic on Big Bear Boulevard. It's not that bad. Well, uh, we might want to make a right though, I don't know. We got all these people coming this way. Nobody coming this way. Oh, now they're coming this way. At least I don't have someone behind me, so I'm not worried about holding anybody up. I don't know why I worry about that so much in this type of weather, but I'm just extra considerate like that. Just like most of you are. That's why we get into accidents, because we're trying to speed up because the people behind us are going really fast and we don't want to hold them up. Okay, I think we got our chance here. Right after this black truck. Yep, here we go. Boom. I don't think you guys need to be stuck in traffic though because you guys have probably been stuck in plenty of traffic down there so we'll shut it off for right now but yeah look at the blue skies over here as I said over at my house we might have a snowflake or two but that's it but as I said any change in the weather I saw on the radar that we had something going on in this part of town even though it wasn't much I wanted to get us something you guys I wanted to get us something shut it off right now. You know, guys, we're not stuck in traffic anymore, but I wanted you guys to see that by the time we get up here, the snowflakes are hardly coming down. And we're still in a part of town where it, it, it snows really good when we get snow. But that part of the town, Boulder Bay and over by the dam, they'll always get a little bit more. They'll always get a little bit more. Except for like at the base of the mountain, like Snow Summit and the base of Bear, since it's right up against the mountain, they'll get just as much snow but even just a hundred yards from there it'll be less it's just amazing but yeah we have a, just a couple snow flurries coming out right now and I think it's about it 
we got these plows right here. Yeah, I think that's that's just about it, you guys. Alright. This snow sure does look beautiful though. Especially where some of it's untouched. It looks so beautiful. take these signs down after they're they're done with all their parking enforcement stuff Dude, what are you doing all right so here we got another slushy street see this is what a lot of the side streets are like guys the main streets are very very well maintained and they do a great great job out there it's just it's, it's too much work to do all the streets constantly all the time so it builds up and especially this street brownie there's a lot of shade on brownie so it gets pretty tough so just be careful but anyway you, you guys take care and the next video will be the aftermath video. well the aftermath or the time lapse tomorrow because i'm going to do a drive around the lake so everyone can see with you know pretty much clear skies what happened to the town how it looks you guys take care bye now <laughs>